Hey guys, it's Simply Erica. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I have a rather different kind of video. It's actually going to be about how to put on a lace front wig. So I thought I'd make this video to kind of give you guys the basics of like how I pluck the um, parts and you know, just how to make a wig look natural. So just stay tuned. Just to give you guys just a quick review about this wig. This is uh, Free Trist Equals Lace Front Wig Keytron in the color 0273-0613. You're gonna get two combs, well, two combs right there. So always pay attention to your guys' wig combs, no matter where they are. And it looks like you're also going to get one down below. And you also have your adjustable straps right there. And like I said, those are for if you need to tighten your wig or if you need to loosen it. So that's what those are for. You're gonna get this much parting space. Looks like two and a half, three inches. You can also, it's curls. You can also see it from the other side. And that's gonna come in handy later down the road, so just keep watching. So, for the basics. What makes a lace front wig is the lace that is toward the front. All this, this little plastic type looking thing you guys see right here, that is lace. So you're gonna need a pair of scissors. Any pair of scissors, something sharp, anything. So with that being said, you're going to cut the lace as close to the hairline as possible. Not too close to where you're cutting the hairs. Don't do that. <laughs> and here is what the wig looks like after you have cut off the lace. And you may need to do a little cleanup. I know I do too, if you didn't cut in a straight line. It's okay. So what you're gonna need next is some tweezers. Any tweezers will do. So what I'm going to do is you're just going to pluck little hairs. So this is what your wig is going to look like right after you have got done plucking. Look at all that. Looks like it's coming out of the scalp. Alright, now we're going to move on to the fun part, which is making your wig look realistic with concealer. So any concealer will do. This is the kind of concealer that I use. Use it. Use any concealer that is close to your skin tone. That's what you want to do so it looks like it's coming out of your scalp, which matches your skin tone. So I'm going to show you guys again, using the head, <laughs> how to do it. Are you going to see that? Going to basically stroke it up and down. So now that I've colored in the inside and the outside of the lace, it definitely makes it look more realistic. Now we're going to jump into how to actually put the wig on. How I normally do it, I put my hair in a low bun and my hair is about shoulder length. Now I also made it a middle part because I want the part to sit in the middle of my head. Now you can do it on the side or the other side, whichever you prefer. It just also helps the part look more realistic. So once you have done that, grab you a wig cap. It can be nude or black. I prefer black. So you just slip that on. So just watch how I do it. People put it on different ways, but I put it on this way. And then you want it to sit 
I might have to cut that lace off a little bit more. Just put it on. And then use those combs and kind of, you see it? And then just tuck it under. Use that other comb and also just tuck it under. And then you'll never have to worry about it falling off. Yeah, so also don't be afraid to put on more uh, concealer once you have it on. Put it so you can adjust it. And you can also blend her with your real hair. Like pull your edges out if you need to. Oh, never mind. But the soft part looking good too. Whichever you choose, I guarantee you will look good. But that's just to give you guys a 101 on how I make my look wigs look realistic and how to actually install a lace front wig. Very simple and she's easy. You don't have to do much to it. So thank you guys for tuning in. Be sure to watch more of my videos to come. Thanks. <laughs>